Hi, everybody. Welcome to the show, Two Dudes Who Love Sports. I'm Damien. Hey, I'm Wesley. I'm from a secret, secret outside location today. Let's check <laughs> it out. Pretty cool, huh? Wow. Is that your laundry? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm from the balcony today. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's more quiet out here. <laughs> mm -hmm. So that's why I look... Uh, Oh, I noticed you got some uh, those Thug Life glasses that you see all the memes on. Yeah, I had it. Huh. I'm going to be thugging, thugging today. Yeah. Thugging in the podcast. So today, it's totally we're totally freestyling this one today, everybody. Maybe be more exciting. Everything. Your glasses. I'm outside today. Freestyle. No Giants yesterday. No Niners. No, no Warriors, really. Yeah. So um, maybe we'll talk a little football or basketball or baseball, maybe. Yeah. Um, Monday night football, uh, Green Bay uh, beat Detroit 35-17. Yeah. So Green Bay, uh, you know, finally played like they're supposed to. Yeah. Jared Goff had two touchdowns, 246 passing yards let's see what uh, my guy aaron Rodgers did four touchdowns he threw for four touchdowns 255 throwing yards and yeah. and andrew jones the running back for for green bay had three receiving touchdowns and he's the running back and yep. he had one rushing touchdown. So he had four touchdowns. I have him in fantasy sports. Of course, I won. Got wow. the highest score of the week. <laughs> so, uh, are you going to look at, uh, do you have, we're going to talk some power rankings, I think. For yeah. Week two after we do a little bit. Let's see. Uh, let's see if the Niners got hated on. We did, dude. Bad. Of course, because we're West Coast. The East Coast always hates. I bet you the East Coast is in charge of the power rankings. <laughs> well, KC is one and one, and they're number one. They're uh -huh. not even undefeated, and they're still number one. And they're still number one. That's pretty yeah. whack. <laughs> yeah, KC is number one. And who's two? Uh Buffalo. Buffalo, New York. Buffalo's Buffalo one and one Bills. also. Yeah, Buffalo's one on one. Um, Buffalo, they have Josh Allen. Uh, to me, maybe the best quarterback in football right now. Uh, he's excellent. That's why they're, they're ranking so high. Mm. Um, speaking of Buffalo, have you have you ever met Buff any Buffalo Bills fans? Uh, I've never met a Buffalo Bill fan. I do not think so in my whole life. Never. They're pretty wild, man. When I used to uh, be an usher at uh, Seahawks Stadium, Niner for life, but I lived there, and I was an usher. The craziest uh, away fans were Buffalo fans because they did not listen to me. They were just big-ass country hillbilly-type-looking dudes with beer and fucking fat, six-foot-four, and uh, they just didn't give a fuck about my small ass telling them to sit down and move. But they were pretty wild, the Buffalo. But they were cool. They were cool. They were passionate. So they finally have a good team. If they're, uh, you know, when's the last time Buffalo has been good since Jim Kelly? <laughs> <laughs> Thurman losing, Thomas. Like, since losing hella Super Bowls in a row. Andre Reid. Yeah. That, then they lose four in a row. Like, yeah. Crazy. So shout out to Buffalo. What's up? You haven't yeah. been here for a while. Welcome to the party. <laughs> shout out to Buffalo Bills. Welcome to the party. Um, who's number three? I'm just curious. Tampa Bay Bucks. I would think they're one because they're looking, you know, Tom Brady and all those, all that off Gronk is back. Old ass mm. Gronk is like how many touchdowns in the last two games, three or four or something. So, so he's, so to me, I would have Tampa number one. Cause they just got all these good receivers. They got a good D um, but yeah, that's kind of weird. Uh, through three, I kind of see. Wait till you see the next few. Okay, what's the next few? Uh, four LA Rams. Mm -hmm. Okay, whoa, LA Rams is number four. They're two and oh, LA Rams is four, huh? LA Rams, wow, LA Rams. 
they have what's his name at QB, the uh the old Detroit quarterback. What the hell is his name? Uh, what is his name? What is his name? It is drum roll, drum roll, drum roll, guy. drum roll, drum Stafford? roll. Matthew Stafford, yes. Yes, yeah, Stafford. Yes, Matthew Stafford. Sorry, guys. Yeah. Uh, we're freestyling today. So, yeah, he's a he's, you know, he's a good QB. Throw bombs. Stafford. Who else is in there? Uh, after the Rams is Baltimore Ravens, who is also one in one. Okay, Baltimore. They and they had a uh, they had a huge win yesterday. It was a close game. Uh, mm. Yeah, they had a big win. Uh, their quarterback looks amazing, though. Who they they got a uh, Lamar? Lamar? Yes, Jackson? that guy. Lamar Jackson. Uh, I'm not. I think you're right. Mm-hmm. I bet you the viewers. Are, yeah, Lamar Jackson. You got it on the money. Yeah, yeah, he's raw. He is. Uh, he got MVP of the league last year. Yeah, he guy. got MVP. So he's he's legit. Um. Who was number three again? I'm sorry. Who did you say? Uh, was three, three was Tampa Bay. Four was Rams. Five was Baltimore. Six is oh. Cleveland Browns. Wow. Right. Who's their quarter? Is Baker Mayfield still their quarterback? Yes. 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 Is he doing? Yes. He's doing too many commercials, bro. He needs to get. He needs to get back in the um, on the practice field or something. <laughs> Baker <laughs> Mayfield. Baker he's Mayfield. on uh, every single channel when I. When I'm watching the game, it's Baker Mayfield doing some commercial, yeah, man. Big He's getting Baker. Paid. Good for him. Okay, so far, Cleveland and the Rams, I don't think should be in front of the Niners, but. Okay, the Niners are next after Cleveland. Where, we what are, number are we? One, seven? two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm fine with that. Sure. I think the year seven. that we made the Super Bowl, we we were during this time at the same place. Yeah, so, uh, we won two games in the road on the road. I think we should be like, personally, I think we should be like five or four. Number five seems fair. Yeah, I don't but, even uh, know what's up with Cleveland. I guess that it's the Baker Mayfield presence. They got some. Uh... <laughs> they got Nick Chubb, hella good running back. Cool, uh, good uh, running back Chubb, name, right? Yeah. C-H-U-B-B. Perfect. Perfect. Like, oh, what? What? I'm going to chub all over. <laughs> chub over you guys. <laughs> kind of like Chub Rock. Yeah. Like chub I Rock. I don't know about Chub Rock. <laughs> that one <clears throat> song. <laughs> Ooh. Um, so you want to see is just the top 10? What are the next three, I guess? Uh, right. Seattle. Ooh, they uh, lost. New England and Dallas. New England's nine. Wow. Wow. Well, they got Mac Jones as the rookie. Mm. Rookie QB. Damn, nine? I didn't think they would even be top ten. We guess New England. Weird. I would think the Raiders. Raiders should be bet uh, over New England, I think. Raiders are 2-0. Oh. D- d- you know, cars are Raiders, passing for over putting 300 Raiders yards. Raiders down like 20th, bro. Well, yeah, that's kind of weird. I think I think Raiders should be definitely top fifteen. To me, top about ten. Number ten seems right for the Raiders. Yeah, they're two and zero, and they're way they're nineteenth. And they have like a legit team. They got uh, yeah, David Chucky Carr's back. David Carr's Carr's cool. thrown for over three hundred yards a game. Healthy. You know they got their uh, they got a really good tight end. They got some good receivers. Mm-hmm. You know, um, they're legit this year. I think uh, Raiders can make a make a run mm-hmm. for the playoffs this year and the dream super bowl would be niners versus raiders <laughs> that would be you get a bunch of fights in the parking lot like always with those guys oh yeah shootings yeah <laughs> oh my gosh I, I i forgot to this just popped in my head uh i saw it via michael rapaport uh he showed the Cleveland Browns fans fighting each other in the, at a, a tailgate party. It was insane. Did you see that? No. It was insane. It was like, and it's good footage. You probably could find it easy uh, on YouTube. But it was a Cleveland Browns fans last Sunday, and they were just a big fight. And it's very clear, and it's just really stupid. It just they're just a bunch of dumb drunk idiots uh, 
fighting for some bullshit against their own fans. <laughs> yeah, but it was worse. kind of funny because there was like a train part, like there's like six guys like behind each other. I was like, what the fuck are they doing? It was like a train of guys like whoa, like falling and like it was pretty funny. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Check that out. Good old NFL fan fights. Never disappoint. Yeah. So um <clears throat> what else? We have Giants tomorrow. Gausman or Ace is pitching against the Padres. Gals. So um, his ERA is 2.68, I think. So that's looking good. Uh, Padres don't know who's starting yet. Um, so that's some news. Uh, and um, why don't you tell them we have our top 10, everybody, for next uh, next Sunday. It's, 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 it's going to be a good one. It's going to be a real good one. Um. What's the top 10, Damien, for this for this uh, Saturday? Sorry. It's going to be the top father-son sports duos of all time, top 10. So, you know, the dad plays sport and the son plays sports. Any sport could be golf, could be badminton, could be tennis, could be baseball. Top 10 yeah. sport father-son duos of all time. That's Saturday. Or maybe, maybe we even can do um maybe if like a mom was an Olympian and their son was like a was like a professional basketball wanna, player. You want to just too, do maybe. parental parental unit and what do they call yeah. it? child unit? <laughs> yeah. Well, well, I'm just saying. Uh, All right, that's cool. I know, I, I know you want J- Javel McGee and his mom. I know you want. Yeah. No. No. Kyle Corver. No, that's Kyle your number Corver. one. Kyle Corver and his mom. Uh, like best shooters or something but there's some yeah. uh, let's just do like parents and son or son and yeah it's son and daughter even maybe, okay maybe okay let's keep it let's keep, yeah. it, uh, let's keep it equal for Cause, everybody because you know maybe like uh reggie miller's sister Ooh. i don't know has like a good ass uh has a good ass son in basketball or something you know or something <laughs> so guys we're doing this like blindly uh I, ha- I know a few, but I don't want to give any out because I don't want all, all our answers to be the same. No, we can't tell each other. No, no that's we, not, I don't even never, want to... We never tell each other. It's a surprise to each other. Right. Mm-hmm. That's why some might be the same and uh, a lot of them aren't. You right. Catch my drift. It's like, it's like a surprise. I, I have some good ones, though. I have some good ones. I'm not going to talk about I already them. got whoo, some hitters. I got some hitter. Ooh, I can't even tell you. I got some hitters. Secret. I got some good secret ones. Uh, yeah, I, I wrote a couple down, but I, I'm, I'm not going to say these them. down on paper. Actual binder. Shit, I was paper. writing them down on my notes on my on my phone. I think. Let me check. Okay, I got. I got. I got. I got. I got some hitters. I got some fucking hitters. That no one will think of. Really? <laughs> yes. Some cutty ones. Some hmm. cutty ones. Hmm. 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 Cutty ones. I promise you. I promise you. I promise you my number one is going to be amazing. <laughs> That's all I got to say. Hmm. Um, hmm. 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 But um, anything else, you know, um, we got we got Giants playing tomorrow. Um, maybe we'll do um, something on Thursday night football, either tomorrow or the day after tomorrow. Yeah, like uh, pick them. We'll like, see uh, who's 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 on Thursday. Uh, great question. Great question. Who's on Thursday, people? Hopefully, I think it's a good one actually. Um, let me check, guys. Um, who's on Thursday? Help me. <laughs> okay, what do we got? You want me to uh, ask Siri? <laughs> Siri, who's playing NFL on yeah. Thursday? She's the best. Please do. Because it only has my like niner schedule. I don't want that. Uh Friday. Well, Friday, 7 a.m. for us. Uh Panthers, Texans. Panthers, That's an interesting Texans. one. We can learn something about those teams. So I'm down to do that game. Yeah, who's the QB for the Panthers now? Who knows? I don't know. Um, I have no idea. Sorry, everybody out there. We didn't uh, do our research. 
for this show. Yeah, it's a freestyle um, today. That's why I'm wearing the But that's why I want to do it. Freestyle so glasses. Can, uh, and I told everybody many times, uh, basketball is my strength. Um, uh, quarterback, Sam Darnold for the Carolina Panthers. Sam Darnold. And who is the other team they're playing? Sam Darnold? Yeah, he's good. Uh, he's Texans, good. Texans. Uh, <laughs> I have no idea who's theirs. I'm going to find out now. It is QB, QB, QB. It's not Davis Mill. Uh, Tyrod Taylor. Tyrod Taylor. Mm-mm. Doesn't <laughs> ring a bell. Oh, no, Deshaun Watson. Oh, Deshaun Watson. That oh. rings a bell. No, but he's in trouble, I think. I think he's not in the league right now. In trouble? Actually. In trouble? He got into some uh, controversy, I think. Google Deshaun not... Watson. That's not the massage thing, is it? No. <laughs> Won't be active. No, somebody was doing the weird massages. That was... So Who is that? Quarterback. That was not Deshaun Watson. I don't want to say that. Yeah. Um, but uh, Tyra Taylor. Different guy. Oh, Tyra yeah. Taylor. 22 active lawsuits with allegations of sexual assault and any inappropriate behavior. Damn, 22 lawsuits. 22? Yeah. yeah. 22 yeah. lawsuits? Yeah. We can Holy get in. We can do a whole podcast crap. about just that. Yeah. Gee, Sean is going hammer out here. <clears throat> yeah. Dude. So, yeah. <laughs> so, that Tyra is, Taylor. Man. Yeah. Contra, yeah. Very. Uh, you know, the, the guy for the uh, Los Angeles Dodgers, they're, um, one of their ace pitchers, same type of thing. Mm-mm. And that's why um, he hasn't really played this year. Uh, he was one of their aces. Um, what was his name? I can't remember his name, and I had him in fantasy baseball. But uh, um, it was one of the aces for um <clears throat> the LA Dodgers. Um, and they already have four aces on their team. But with if he didn't fuck up, they probably would have easily easily been been favored to win the World Series this mm-hmm. year. I can't remember his name. If you know that guy's name for the Dodgers, uh, leave a comment. But um, he's in big trouble, and he's not going to play. He's hasn't played in months because it's the same type of shit. Mm-hmm. Uh, Watson, a lot of allegations like that. So wow, twenty two. Yeah, it's a lot. Going? It's going it's OT, a lot. overtime, working overtime out there. Right. Damn, bro. Whew. Putting your, all your NFL money at risk, man, doing that shit. Right. I don't know. I'm not going to say if he's guilty or not, but 22 allegations, that's that's like up there. <laughs> it's like Bill Cosby. That's Bill Cosby's numbers. That's Bill Cosby shit. <laughs> Bill Cosby numbers. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Well. All right. Well, uh, see you tomorrow, man. I have a bunch uh, of prep work to do now. Let's get this. uh, (laughs) Let's get these. uh, Get these fucking. um, Shit, I can't think right now. Uh, Tough, tough day at the office. Home office. Jeez, man. See my background? Check it out. See see your neighbor in your neighbor's windows. There's the river and the buildings, Crescent Mall. You didn't see the it's huge neighbor. rainbow today, though. That shit was right above no, the building. It was like out of the top of your building. Check my Facebook. You'll see it. <clears throat> or Instagram. All right. Those things. All right. So, okay. two dudes who love sports signing out. And uh, Sign up. En- enjoy your uh, day whenever you're watching it. And happy mid Austin. Autumn, mid autumn, uh, mid autumn festival, festival mid-autumn day festival. tomorrow. Happy mid autumn <laughs> festival to the people that celebrate it. It's uh-huh. awesome. I had two mooncakes.
Mm, mm, mm. Was it the meat mooncake? They have yep. meat mooncake. Yeah, oh, okay. my favorite. They got so many different mooncakes. The egg man. with it's the dry, insane. dry hard egg inside. Oh, they have so good. many different ones. They oh, have sweet God. ones, foodie ones, meaty ones. They got a bunch. Yeah, they hooked us up yesterday. Yeah, so Saigon's coming out of the uh, lockdown soon. So hopefully, maybe yeah. we'll come on location with some live sports bar stuff for you soon hopefully yeah, sports bar cool. opens we'll be out we'll be out there all right cool west have a good cool, day man. have a good night everybody peace from two dudes peace